Welcome back to Underwater Math. Today we are going to explore volume and calculate volume using the area of the base times the height. When we look at a rectangular prism, there are several parts we want to look at. Here we have the base of the prism. If we know the area of the base of the prism, then we can calculate the volume. Each layer would have the same volume, so we can multiply the area of the base times the height of the prism to calculate the volume. Let's give it a try. Here we have a rectangular prism. The base has a width of 2 and a length of 3. To calculate the area, we multiply the width by the length, or 3 by 2, which is 6. Now, the prism is 3 units tall. We can multiply the area of the base, 6, by the height, 3, to find the volume. 6 times 3 equals 18, so the volume is 18 cubic units. Remember, volume is also measured in cubic units. Let's check out another one. Here we can see the base is 3 units by 4 units, making 12 square units. The prism has 2 layers. 12 times 2 equals 24. This rectangular prism has a volume of 24 units cubed. This time we don't have unit cubes to help us out, but that is okay. We can still find the area of the base by multiplying the length by the width. Here we have 10 inches and 4 inches, which is 40 inches squared. Next, we will multiply by how tall the figure is, which is 3 inches. 40 inches squared times 3 inches is 120 cubic inches. Nice work. I think you've got this down. Remember, to find volume, you multiply the area of the base times the height. Have fun practicing.